In this video I play a tank destroyer pretending to be an anti-air, armed with a 40mm cannon that can fire 4 shells per second. This is the AMX-13 DCA-40. Hope you guys enjoy this intro, where I get 18 kills. And black buses apparently. That's our M10. Come up. Oh, it's a Sherman. Another M10. He's also gone. What is this guy? A very unfortunate Sherman. Please reach him. Please reach him. Okay. <laughs> Man, that's out. No more 50 cal. He's chasing me. Rip. Killed by a plane. But yeah, 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 we got bombed. <laughs> I don't know why people revenge bomb me in a plane when they know exactly what's gonna happen. That and I haven't done a cast video in ages, I've got withdrawals. Oh, there's two guys down here. And one and two. Yoink. I think my teammate's on that one on nine. There he goes. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Here it comes. Here it comes, dude. You're gonna regret shooting at me. <laughs> I saw you fire at me. You're absolutely guilty as charged, dude. <laughs> A child. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> the steward's still firing at me. Let's give him the kill, right? There he goes, dude. There he goes. <laughs> yeah, not shooting me this time. GG. <laughs> Bonjour, salut, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out the AMX-13 DCA-40 tank destroyer that can also shoot down planes in War Thunder. Now, if you enjoyed that classic style Hot Boss intro, please remember to like the video. It would help out the channel massively. If you want to see more of them, let me know in the comments box below. Now, this vehicle has been in the game for quite a long while now, actually since the introduction of the French Tech Tree. And it's an SPAA that was at 4.7 that's been moved down to 4.3. Now, this boy has a 40mm buffers with 94mm of penetration, a fairly decent rate of fire, and it's also in the default belt. Now, this SPAA actually shoots me down more than any other SPAA in the game at this BR. I think just most people that are using it are very good with it, but it also has just an insane velocity for an anti-aircraft shell. It's almost as fast as a 50 cal, but it obviously hits like an effing truck. It is very destructive. On top of this, the chassis itself is actually pretty good mobility wise. It doesn't have very good gun depression, obviously it's an anti-air, but it has almost complete vertical elevation, meaning that you can shoot planes that are pretty much directly above you. It's quite hard to master this thing, and I did struggle with it for a wee while. I played five games in it, I did very well. I got plenty kills on tanks, some kills on airplanes, but generally with open top SPAA, especially when your ammo rack is I mean, everywhere, eh, it's not very survivable at all. Even if a plane's diving head on down on top of you, you're both likely going to die or you'll just get hurt so much it'll take you ages to repair. And then another plane will come along and pick you off. Now, I have footage here of plenty of kills in the five games that I had and a lot with this thing, mostly with this thing. And a lot of people actually, I'm very interested in this. People have missed the cast gameplay. So I've included it this time round with two of my favourite planes in War Thunder. This is the F6, F5N. It's got 20 mils, individually launched rockets and individually dropped bombs too now, which you'll see much to my surprise eh, in the video along here. And then, as you guys know, my favourite dive bomber in the game. Eh, this is a Hell Diver. Again, 20mm cannons, two separate bomb drops. This thing is so much fun to play. It outturns even the best of planes once it gets uh, slow. It's super fun. Th this video is super cool. I enjoyed it a lot. It's been good to go back and play a vehicle that's actually half decent. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy this footage as much as I did play it. Let's get into battle. Right, we get unfortunately put on a very bad map for this guy. We'll see though. We're, we're not facing Germany again. It's just Russia, Britain and China. I think this dude is a... Uh, 
coming towards B and then the main road. Oh, is that Sherman up there? That man is uh, probably pretty upset about that. Absolutely yoinked. If we didn't get his gunner early on, he could have just one tapped us and that would have been the end of it, right? Uh, I'm probably going to get artillery pretty badly too, once we start capping this. <laughs> and uh, artillery now with overpressure is not ideal at all. I'd rather this guy just moved on. We're not going to get any prizes for trying to kill that guy, that's for certain. Uh, So I got his breach. And he's on fire. Oh come on. Come on, DCA. This guy's breaches out as well now. Uh, I think that T34 that was there before is now gone too. This thing is an absolute murder machine on it. Yeah. Okay, we're good. And I think a plane's coming in too. Yeah, there is a plane coming in. Have we got the cap? We got two kills and an assist in us. We may as well drop Ari on those two guys. This this dude's coming in pretty hard. Who who smoked over here? Oh no. There's a guy coming this way too. I think this guy's gonna be pretty hard to kill by the way, this aircraft. Where is he? Is he going for a spawn or what? God, I can't see a thing, dude. Actually I hit him twice. Oh, it's artillery actually, isn't it? <laughs> I can hardly see him. I need to divert him away with his gigantic bombs. We might be dead here. Yeah, we're good for now. <laughs> so far, so good, then. Not, not, not that I wasn't absolutely terrified the entire time we were shooting at that guy. Right. There's a guy in the water and I wonder if I can just bully components out of this KV. Oh, this is a mistake. Somebody's pushing me. Something very big. It's another KV. Yeah, are we? Please. Please drop off that, dude. That would be so funny. What is this thing? Another plane's coming in, too. Damn, I just missed a Sherman. Don't have the depression. I can pen him at this range. Oh, a T 34 is coming. I need to force this T-34 to try and drive up the hill in front of me. Stop Mario on me. He's a clever girl. It's a clever girl, dude. Oh, hey, that guy's dead. A Werbo one killed him. Wait, oh, sorry. A Ta-154. What a strange vehicle to bring in, by the way. Someone, dude. Keep, keep it coming. Keep it coming. He might shoot my roof. Oh, and I got killed from the other. Oh, I got killed with an arty. <laughs> it landed right on top of me. Oh well. Yeah, there's nothing you can do about that. We got out skilled. Well, we're getting sea bags, so maybe we'll be okay. A36 missed his bombs. We're gonna go. We're gonna shop, right? We're not gonna drop our bombs on the first thing we see. We're gonna shop. We, uh, uh, actually, that Cromwell just killed our teammate on the cap there. This other guy might push in to be. The dude that's in his spawn sniping right now is pretty harmless at the time being. Um, I think we just need to keep the vehicles off of this cap right now. I think he stopped it yet. Right, and then we're going to end up with two on B. So I'm just going to get some altitude. And we we'll see if we can time this to see if we can get a double kill on this KV in the water and the T-34 is pushing up we got a teammate moving up here too though right maybe we just help our teammate out rather than try and do any fancy business
Wait, one's dead. And then that KB will be gone. And then that's us good. We, are, we, we cleared the B. With the help of our friend. Oh, look at that. An Achilles, I think. Or a 36. I think it may be. No, it's a, it's a Chinese M10, maybe. They're looking at me. There we go. We got a rocket off on him. After a quick strafe. Right, A is safe. We're getting B now. And there's two enemy planes coming in. What is that? It's not... A, is that a Matilda or a Valentine? <laughs> All my racket, r rackets... All my rockets hit around them. Oh, the other plane's coming too. It is my, maybe? No, it's a TU. Oh, there's a third plane. Well, now we're dead, right? I'm okay with this. A PE too. Good, he's dead. The other guy coming for another head on. Was that a P47, was it? He's not looking so good, is he? Oh my god, I'm so bad. Still got him, though. Roger, roger, roger. You might crash here. Almost. Chinese P40. You're yeah, actually pretty scary, this thing. Yeah, I don't think he knows how to fly. Yeah, I die, apparently, with my rudder. Got him crit. Some tail damage is never bad. And... Yoink. GG, then. That was a game and a half. That was pretty cool, I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that, dude. Nice, a nice win. <laughs> He's still falling down. There we go. Oh, a nice, a 10k. Cool. We'll take it. Okay, we're on White Rock again. Let's go, dude. Mickey the Mouse. Head towards these buildings on this side, right? Over here. We got a wee bit of, We got a wee bit of wiggle room to kind of move around and be constantly in cover, hopefully. It just... It depends on where my teammates want to go. A Churchill and a Firefly coming this way. This guy too. If the other dudes go away around the other side, then it means we can hopefully harass enemies and get them side shot. I think there's an enemy below me here. Where? Yes. Funky Clunk is on his way. Come right in front of me. I don't have depression, right? Oh, it's a flag bus. Can't hear a thing. Oh, and a chappy. Oh, he's dead. Right, okay. It's worked out well for us so far. A guy drove past us as well. He's right there. Stug. Can't really see him now. Found him. Another Stug. Stug G maybe? This is one of the most violent tanks in War Thunder I would say. I think we're about to get hunted down, I'm gonna move. We're going to move, then. I'm happy with three kills, we're also getting artillery, which is not great. Being sneaky. Somebody here. And someone to my right. I think I was Red Tracer? No, another chappy, maybe. Another oh, flag bus. Actually. This is a... Uh, this thing is a bully, right? <laughs> Against chamber vehicles is definitely a bit of a bully. We just need to wait till the planes turn up as well. Oh, there we go. We got one. It's just my job. The zoom on this is too much.
Right, I'm I'm surrounded by teammates, so I'm assuming I'm gonna be okay. Are you are you gonna crash? Yep. Well, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna take that kill for myself. That was a maneuver kill. Thank you the mouse, there's a guy in front of us. Part right there. I'm just firing off into the distance and still I guess where he is. Another plane is coming, no? Right, he's dead, good. Right, this little spot over here is really good. Super trolley spot. And we'll hopefully get eyes on this plane. Oh, an R3T20. There's two planes, actually. And an enemy there. He turned his side on me. I need to be careful of that R3. Where did the aircraft go? Oh, he's attacking the BB1. This other one is fairly low, I think. Ish. ME410, we're gonna get bombed, likely. That's a, that's a heavy hit, but we also got shot ourselves pretty bad. Okay, he's got two engine fires to deal with. That little R3 is up on there. Can I R3 that? Yeah, I can actually. Is that plane still alive, by the way? With two fires? No, he's dead now. That plane's dead too. No, I only got half of his tail. That R3. Oh, I got him with the RA, I don't believe it. Okay, the plane's going back. I think I hear another aircraft. Yeah, I definitely do. I don't know how I heard them, but I did. Come on, Buzz. You can do it, Buzz. You can do it, dude. Don't let this man kill you. I'm so bad. Okay. <laughs> Nine kills is pretty spectacular. Do we take another one out or do we go plane? Do we take another one out or do we go plane? I think we go plane. Let's go. I think nine kills proves the point that it's a pretty decent vehicle, right? See, I'm glad that R3 is dead. We might die in a head on up here, but it doesn't really matter. I'm okay with that. We'll go down and help this guy once we've died to him, right? Is there another one lower than me? Right. We're only slightly... Oh, the other one's dead. Is that another R3? No. It's that M16, I think. Also gone. One and two and pull up. Okay, both those two guys are dead. There's another plane coming in or going to the airfield. One of the two. Awesome. One of the two, dude. This, this radar is really confusing me. But the, the green things look like tracer fire almost to me. Oh, that rocket just missed. Oh, my teammate just got shot down by what? A uh, Oswind. Oh, I see him, I see him. Can I rocket him? Left left wings first. Left wings first. Looking good. There we go, perfect. Right. Enemy aircraft? Yeah, there he is. Oh, God, there goes my... My engine's not gonna survive now, dude. <laughs> it's like bright orange now. It's bright orange now. Can I get this Sherman on fire though? Yeah, we can. Oh, I missed again. Yeah, but my plane's not doing so well. We at least got a little bit of 
energy still. Retained. I'm happy if this shaman kills me. He deserves it. For surviving all that nonsense. Left wing on this shaman. Yeah, he's just pilot sniped one. Another Oswind. <laughs> Another one. Right, we're going for the Oswind. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully, fingers crossed. This thing is an absolute monster now. It was very good before, but individual bomb drops, right? And individual rockets. 20 mils, 50 kills. It's got it all, dude. Oh, my wing tip. No, we're going down. <laughs> hey, there we go, dude. Six kills, though, and then there goes the Oswind as well. It'll take... Oh God, it's twice, twice of Haranook. I wish they would add some low tier big ordnance. Not to end the match, right? Just like, I don't know, kind of like P8 bomb sized V1 rocket or like a blockbuster or something that you can spawn in. That'd be super cool, right? He's just refusing to die though. Love these games. What are you calling out? Oh, I see it. Right, this is uh, this is two bomb drops. But we can top down attack this guy. Oh, whatever, we'll, just... we'll get rid of him anyway. Oh, never mind. What happened to my bombs? They were pretty dead on, or I thought. He drove forwards. Clever girl. Imagine. Look at his tracks, though. What's going on here? I can't pin his roof somehow. That, that shaman's annoying me now. You got away with it last time, dude. On your last life. <laughs> I can't see him because of the smoke. We'll get him later on. Right, there he goes. Ouch. Hey, one kill so far on this thing was just... Not brilliant. <laughs> We're done a half our ammo and a half our payload. God, the smoke is really thick. I'll drop it anyway. You never know. Perfect. Right, what, what is going on down here? Another Sherman. Right, the only way I can kill this guy is a very lucky pen through the roof or set him on fire three times. But it looks like our team is uh, actually starting to lose. Okay, we got a lucky pen. 170 rounds left. Two enemies left. And we've got three friendlies. Oh, what was our main gun attempt? Very half decent shot, dude. Gave me a fright, actually. A stug. Top down attack time. It's a super interesting game. He's doing a really good job of avoiding me. A Panzer four over this way. Be very clever. Be, be this guy. Be that guy. Super good player. He just drift, he's just he's actually at, oh he got burned to death. I think he just jet out. Might spawn a verbal one now. Very likely. That would be that would be the clever thing to do. Right there goes that Panzer four. There's 76 rounds left. Sherman just spawned in. No, I think he left. That's a shame, dude. This, so it's War Daddy that's left. There's one guy. Can't get the pen on him. Oh! Oh, I think it's him! Or maybe maybe it's the Panzer that... From earlier. 34 rounds left. This, this guy's got... An unlimited belt. I should be dead by now, but he's not shooting at me. You wait until I'm flying straight at you. I'll crash on top of you, dude. I'll do it. I missed him. I missed him. But it looks like... It looks like we got this match. Possibly. Right, let's go. AMX again. One more spawn. It's just me and three others. There goes the anti here. What an absolute menace this thing can be, right? I'm not saying that, like... Maybe it should go back to 47. I think a lot of anti airs are very... Under-tiered. What <laughs> moment? <laughs> How many tickets do you have left? God, dude, there's a, a lot of death. A lot of killing. 
Nice one, Daddy. Nice job, dude. What are we on? Almost a 20 bomb. And they're on A. Hey, what we'll do? We're probably on the back side here, right? Angry French man. Do your thing. See, this war daddy guy, he could win this. Genuinely. It could be a thing. I'd love to see him do it. Oh, as a stug is. Oh, that guy just cheered out. He must have got stuck. Anyway, war daddy's dead. He might spawn something else, though. But it might be too expensive for him to bring something. He is. outed. GG. Oh, wow. That was a match and a half. So the DCA-40 really it scares the bejesus out of me. This is on par with the Whirlwind, I would say, at 4.3, where I think, honestly, the Whirlwind should be as well. They're very equal, I think, at taking out aircraft. This thing obviously has more pen and less rate of fire, so really it's better at dealing with tanks. It's just such a good anti-air and such a good anti-tank vehicle. On an urban map, which sadly I didn't really get, uh, this thing can just tear through the enemy's ranks like nothing on earth. It's so, so good. As well as that, I got to take out a couple of cast planes and I really enjoyed myself. And if you enjoyed this video too, please remember to leave it a wee like. Definitely don't skip this vehicle. It's your best anti-air till you get basically the, the radar boy on the wrong texture here. Uh, the MX-30 DCA. It's good enough all the way up to 6770. It's difficult to deal with jets unless they're flying straight at you. But it can still deal with light tanks, BMPs and stuff like that. It eats them alive. As usual, I'd like to thank everyone who supports the channel and those who support the channel financially too. Over on Discord and Patreon, for all the tier 3 Discord members that get a shout out, that's Illustrious, Shadow Wolf, Blue Bio, Gifted Greed, Millie Mills, Stoyan and the Reformation, and to everyone over on Patreon. Thank you guys very much. And a special thanks to all the tier 3s there too. That's Bilka the Tactical Broccoli, Matthew S, Jesse Mills, the Tackle Guy, Toast McGee, Ander Stormwind, Archangel Ari, Bramination Sexy, Charles D, Ethan, Excavation Nation, Gifted Greed, Handsome Tortilla, Ken the Salt Lord, Kino Subasa, Ralph Rige, Ryan Yu, Tectonic the Firepiper, the Reformation, and of course his son. Uh, Nox, uh, Trash Panda, Vanian, Warpig, Zema, Yuck Bullshaft, Mortanen, Stoyan, Wizzlebriff, J Tommy, Mr. Buzzwell, Shmoo, and Stuart Netherton. And to everyone else still watching, thank you very much for watching. Much love, and bye bye.